Hey guys, it is Name. I'm back again with a new video. This video I am so excited to finally be doing in particular because it's highly, highly requested. Not just by people on YouTube, but by my family and my friends and random strangers. They always like, oh my god, what do you use on your hair? How do you get it to look like this? What do you do? I'm finally, finally getting to record this because it'll help me to answer that age-old question of what I use in my hair. I hope you get suggestions on products to try and I hope it helps one of you at least. That would really make my day and my life. <laughs> if I was trapped like a, on an island or desert, <laughs> totally random I know, and I could only get access to two products so I could only have two products, what I would peak would be my shea butter mix. My shea butter mix I made personally with products that I bought, all organic products. I will pick this. This is freaking amazing stuff. I'm actually going to make a video on how I made this, so you can look out for that. This can be used for hair and buddy. I use it for both. Yeah, so I would grab this. It's that good. Yeah, that just that just happened. And also a conditioner. This is the conditioner that I'm loving right now. It really doesn't matter. Any conditioner, my Shea Butter Mix, I'm good. First of all, the shampoo I use is the Giovanni Hydrating clarifying shampoo. I love this stuff. This is actually my sister's bottle. She's been generous enough to share with me. <laughs> she got this probably like two years ago. We don't use shampoo that often. That's why it's still that much. And I poured half of it into another bottle that I still have. So this lasts so long. This, when it runs out, I will be buying again. It makes my hair feel like silk when I'm washing it. I freaking love it. I used to buy deep conditioners. I stopped liking them or the one I used to buy so I don't want to waste your time telling you about a product that I don't like anymore. But right now and forever I've been loving organic root stimulator moisturizing condition replenishing conditioner. Oh my gosh. I've been using this stuff since I was relaxed. They used to come in little packets in the relaxer box, if you remember. I used this when I was relaxed. I used this when I was transitioning. I am using it right now that I'm natural. It's that good. If it's still working, you don't need to change it. If it's not broken, you don't need to fix it. It smells great. It is feels great. It mixes well with other products for deep conditioning. And by other products, I mean my honey and my oils. It's just amazing stuff. So if I'm not using this, this would be for more of like a moisturizing deep conditioner. If I did want to do like a protein deep conditioner, I would just right now I would make my own so I would either beat up eggs or I would use like mayonnaise mix it up with other stuff like honey and oils again and use in my hair I don't spend money on deep conditioners right now I'm open to you but I'm just good for now until I find something to try I just briefly talked about this conditioner the herbal essences health hydration moisturizing conditioner it has great slip if I'm not using this I'm actually using the Tresemme uh, Naturals Curl Hydration. I think that's what it's called. I'll put a picture right here. I love this. I used to use that a ton, but this is what I'm on right now. I also pick other Tresemme products when I'm in the aisle. I just basically pick anything that looks good to me at the time. Like any, if I like honey in the moment, I pick a honey flavor. This is honey. Uh, this is a uh, Kupuaku Butter. I have no idea what that is. But yeah, I just go by what looks good. But this is a staple, definitely. I didn't use leave-in conditioners for so long until I went to the States uh, end of last year-ish. And then I found the Shea Moisture Coconut and Hibiscus Curl and Style Milk. Jeez, this stuff my hair adores. I've gone through a bottle already. See that? I wish I got like four more of these or so, uh, because this is my last bottle, I'm really, really sad. This is amazing. It makes my hair feel so soft. It leaves my curls in. Look at my curls. I use this. It keeps my curls popping. I mean, this is what is this? Six day, six day hair. It's hair wash day actually, and it's still, it still doesn't look that good. I know, <laughs> but it's amazing. It makes my hair feel soft and keeps my curls in, and it's just awesome. I looking for where I can buy this. If you find someone who can send this to me, I would love the person forever. I'm kidding. Don't find someone to send that to me. The other living I got when I was in the States is this Cantu Natural Hair Coconut Curling Cream. I tried this and it felt really good. I used it, say, twice or so. 
it works good makes my hair feel soft it was just a really good leave-in that I enjoyed using so it's kind of not yet a staple but it's getting there I have this shea butter mix I already talked about this video is not about it so I don't want to go ahead ranting about it it's amazing it's uh, made out of shea butter that I buy like this and then I mix it up with some awesome stuff and it becomes this I will make a video on this this is amazing I use it for my buddy for my hair it's great my coconut oil you've seen this in my other videos it is pure organic extra virgin coconut oil it's as organic as it gets <laughs> put in this little bottle and that's what I actually use day to day but this stuff you've even seen in my other videos I've been using it for so long it's almost gone it's like one third left in the bottle it's amazing I use it for everything I mix it in everything it makes my hair smell like I'm on the island I, I, I dig that smell I bought it for prices right there $12.99 I bought this like two years ago it's money well spent trust me extra virgin olive oil this is from good old Walmart I put it in this I use this every day on my skin actually with my lotion it's amazing for my hair for all the mixtures I do or just to give my hair a little shine at any time this is amazing can do without evil I've been using it since my transitioning days this is my next oil it's grapeseed oil pure extra virgin grapeseed oil all these things I'm using I can let you know in the description box where I bought them from just in case you're from Canada and you would like to get this this is my grapeseed oil I love I put it in a small bottle I do that for a while I, you don't want to take this around I mix it with stuff it's amazing for natural hair last but not the least is my Jamaican black castor oil I love this oil I use it mainly for my scalp and for my mixtures deep conditioning mixes it's good for your scalp just for a scalp massage or if you feel like you have a thinning um, hairline you can just massage it it's a thicker oil it's really really great it's I love this now this is honey pure pasteurized honey it I literally buy this from the dollar store it's just like a dollar something because it's honey and it's going into my hair I'm not eating it like why not I mix this in almost all my deep conditioners I love it I run through this pretty fast and buy other ones I go but this is a staple product honey does good stuff for your hair too everyone needs a good spray bottle for getting water in there getting your little mixture of whatever sometimes I have aloe vera juice or something in there it's just good to get the water into your sections you need a spray bottle I love a spray bottle this is my next staple product this comb this is a white tooth comb well, this I love because I can hang it everywhere I can hang it in the shower on a shelf I can hang it I hang it everywhere as I wash my hair I use this only once a week actually how often do you comb your hair that would be so interesting to find out because I think I'm a weirdo for only combing my hair once a week but I don't know if that's just normal and I'm not a special weirdo yeah so this I use in the shower where when my hair has conditioner in it and it's just soft and mellow that's when I comb my hair for the week I love the white tooth these are my other combs God gave me natural combs for the rest of the week that's why if I was stranded in that island or desert I'm not gonna even be needing a comb because I have combs but this is good for when I want to really feel like why am I playing with this so much <laughs> You're wondering what the hell is she holding? Why, what is that? It is my microfiber hair towel. I'm gonna try and find a picture of me and put it here where I'm with this on. I put it on from the back. It has a button there and then this is able to go and clip on and it, you'll see a picture. It's amazing, it, the fabric is good for your hair. Love, love, love this stuff. You can find it in like any beauty supply store. The next thing is my clips. I don't ever wash or style my hair without putting them in sections because I don't want it to be a tangled mess. I don't want to have to cut it off out of frustration. So these clips are amazing. These are actually my mom's. <laughs> Shout out to my mom who let me just steal these from her and take it as mine. And these are mine. These are actually better, but these are good too. These are used for my deep conditioning. I get them from the dollar store. The label is actually still there. I don't know. Oh, it focuses. Uh, that's a dollar twenty-five from Dollarama. It comes in, I believe, ten caps. 
So there's 10 of them. They're disposable for $1.25. I think that's just my I think that is all my products, my stable products. Let me know what staple products do you use and how many times do you comb your hair in a week or how often do you comb your hair is my question. I would love to know. I just want to know if I'm a weirdo or if that's just normal and I'm thinking I'm a weirdo. I'm just trying to be a weirdo so bad. <laughs> have a good day. Have a good week. Have a good evening, afternoon, wherever you are. I'm so happy that you watched this and I hope you check out my other videos. Subscribe and like this video if you like this video. Stalk me on social media. I'm gonna put them right here. Feel free to stalk me and follow me. Subscribe and come back for more and we can be good friends. I think you're cool.